Hey girls and guys, it's Presley, and today in this video, I'm going to help my young fellow LGBTQ teens who are afraid to come out to their parents. A little helpful advice on my best way to help you guys come out. Helpful advice and all that good stuff. Now, there probably is no best way to come out because a lot of people come out in different ways. Now, there are some people who are afraid of judgment, um, people judging them and stuff, like me. I used to be so, I'm still afraid of people judging me now, even though I came out to my parents already. And that's why I'm taking therapy. <laughs> not because that I'm lesbian. No, 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 no. It's not conversion therapy. Hell no. Fuck that shit. It's just regular therapy for me so I can tackle negativity and people being judgmental. That's what I'm focusing on. Anyway, enough of that. My helpful advice for all of you young teens who are too scared to come out. Well, all I can say is if there is a go-to person that you normally talk to, like a sibling, a friend, or even a parent, try and take things slow and talk to them first. And if things don't go exactly as planned, well, I honestly don't know what to say because I never thought I'd be able to get this far in the video anyway, so. <laughs> but seriously, when I came out as a lesbian, my go-to person that I normally talk to is my mom. And I, I tell her everything whatever happens and ever since i came out as a lesbian before i told her i was a little scared of telling her about my sexuality and she accepted me no matter what and a year after that i came out to my dad and i was too scared to go out um, to come out to my dad because you know I was afraid he was going to be judgmental because he, my dad is never the go-to person I would talk to. Yeah, I tell him some things, but I don't tell him everything because he's a, I shouldn't say, I mean, he, not because he's a guy, probably because of that. I feel like he wouldn't understand me. That's what I was afraid of, him not understanding me because I don't tell him everything. But ever since I told him I was a lesbian, he accepted me too. And there's going to be some people in life who won't accept you. And that's okay. You don't need everyone in the whole wide world to accept you. I even came out to my therapist like last Friday. Last Friday I started therapy and I came out to my therapist and she was super accepting. She is like the nicest therapist I've ever been to. Like, I've done therapy before, like in my freshman year, but I had to go back, I had to do therapy again. So I, I had to do therapy again and this therapist is like the nicest therapist that I've ever met in my whole entire life. And I'm excited to go see her again because she has helped me so far. And I'm hoping she'll help me through um, conquer negativity and judgmental things. Because that's what I'm focusing on in, in um, my sessions in therapy. And anyway, for those of you who are scared to come out, well... I say you need to take things slow first. That's all I can help you with. And if there's anything other other than that that is um, pressuring you or having you're having trouble with, let me know in the comments, by the way. Anyway, um, what inspired me to make this video? Shout out to my older brother, because he helped me inspire make this video, because I was on net, um, Instagram one time and my older brother sent me a video of this NFL football player named Car Carl Nassib. Please correct me if I'm if I'm mispronouncing this guy's name cuz I'm not a I'm not a sports fan at all, so I don't know everybody's names when it comes to sports. So anyway, 
My older brother showed me a video of this foot NFL football player, Carl Nassib, who came out as gay, and he used to be a very private person, and he was scared to tell everyone how he felt. And I can hardly blame him. A lot of people who can't, uh, who um, confront about their sexuality are afraid to tell everyone else. But he said in, his, um, in that video my older brother showed me that he wasn't doing this for attention. He wanted to let everyone know that representation is important. And I... 100% agree that representat representation of the LGBTQ community, if you're afraid to come out, it's very important that you take things slow. Not everybody in the world will come out, and I know it. Some people are still in the closet right now. I can hardly blame them. But no matter if it's Pride Month or not, Representation will always be an important thing, whether if you're gay or straight, it'll always be an important thing in here and in here too. <laughs> well, that's all I have to say in this video. And if you need any more helpful advice from me, and if my video helped you, on coming out to your parents or siblings or anyone that you want to come out to, let me know in the comments because I would love to know. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And I'll see you guys in the next video.